So let's talk about dirty electricity. In order to run the smart meter or any other digital meter, the 240 volts coming down from the power line has to be stepped down to 4 to 10 volts to run the digital components of the meter. You don't have to do this with an analog meter. An analog meter runs passively. So you've got it stepping down, and what this does is it generates what's called dirty electricity. It's also known by electrical engineers as noise on the line, power quality issues, voltage transients and harmonics. There's a variety of different names for it. Dirty electricity is a very good summary of what it is. It's very spiky, again, just like those sm smart meter pulses that you saw. It's up and down and up and down. And all, it's all over the place. Again, it is happening in millisecond blasts. Now, the dirty electricity, your meter, your smart meter is what is creating that. And so every line in your home, every line in this building, if it has a smart meter on it, is contaminated with that dirty electricity. You've got it in all the walls, you've got it above you, and if you have a basement, you have it below you. It is radiating out into the room like this all the time. You can take a meter and you can watch, you can watch the needle just flick, 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 when, in, when you are in a home with a smart meter or an opt-out meter. So the opt-out meter and the regular smart meter, the opt-out meter is a smart meter. The opt-out meter has one single transmitter disabled. Both meters generate dirty electricity. And this pulsed radiation is very, very harmful to health. So there's a picture of dirty electricity. This is, you can measure these things with an oscilloscope. Now, again, a lot of devices in our modern environment also generate dirty electricity. So CFLs generate it. You can see those down at the bottom, and you can see how incredibly up and down and spiky that is. Laptop computers, phone chargers, all of these things generate dirty electricity. What they do not do is contaminate every single circuit in your home. If you plug your laptop in in your office, it is not going to contaminate the circuit in your bedroom. It is not necessarily even going to contaminate the whole line. In addition, you have a choice and it does not generate the huge amount of dirty electricity that smart meters do. Now the other thing that happens is when everybody has these smart meters, all this dirty electricity backs up on the power line. Even if you don't have one, it is going into your home. The amount of dirty electricity in my home has doubled. It has doubled. All my neighbors have smart meters. Both the smart meters and the smart meter radio frequency and the dirty electricity are the spiky pulsed radiation. Scientific studies indicate that pulsed electromagnetic waves are especially deleterious to health. You are being hit with millisecond blasts of this radiation. Dirty electricity is as responsible for the health effects from smart meters as radio frequency, perhaps even more so. People living in homes with opt-out meters are becoming just as sick. So I'll tell you one brief story. There's a family. They were moving from a home with an analog meter to a house that had a smart meter on it. And the mother said, knowing the dangers of radiation from a smart meter, I opted out thinking all would be fine. They moved into the home. The next morning, she and her children woke up vomiting with headaches, nosebleed, ringing in the ears, flu-like symptoms, and the two-year-old scratching her ears. So little kids, you know, they don't have the words necessarily to tell you what's going on. You have to watch what they do. The mother began to experience brain fog and memory problems. She's 32 years old. Her husband thought it was probably all in her head, and that's what usually happens in a family, is that one member who's not experiencing it says, man, you know, I don't know. Usually it's, usually it's the women. Women are more affected than men. There's no doubt about that whatsoever. So the men are going, you know, I don't know about this. And then what happens is they start spending more time at home. A lot of them become affected as well. 
That's what happened to him. So other health effects caused by the opt-out and the smart meters, insomnia, heart palpitations, high blood pressure, mental confusion, anxiety and depression, metallic shocks through the body, dizziness, nausea. Those are just some of the symptoms.